video vixen but yeah i'm home i ain't going out there child it's looking kind of wild hi everyone today is friday august i'm starting this vlog out very very late so this is friday august 6th so i just put in put up at sephora i'm going in here with the intentions of picking up the fenty lip conditioner the fenty lip balm just to kind of keep on hand because i have chapstick but I want something more than just a chapstick, if that makes sense. Like, So that's what I'm looking for. And then I was also looking to see about looking into the Laura Mercier setting powder. But I have the Black Radiance one. And that, that one doesn't do me any bad. So it's like I would just be trying to get it just because of, you know, the name and the color of it. Just to kind of like test it out. So we'll see. Then after this, I'm going to head over to Ulta probably go over to tj maxx as well or home goods to see if i could find me a throw because the throw that i have the throw that i have in the house it's like very linty and it's black so it's time to give that one up like it's 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 actually time to let it go um yeah i'm gonna head over there to see what all i can find and i want some color like i think i want to get me like a rusty orange color like a burnt um red type of color for the couch as just like a throw um to use at the couch but yeah that's about it girl i've been listening to old drake the so far gone album drake like oh, such a vibe anyway we missed the old drake okay i was listening to sooner than later a little bit a night off featuring lloyd like those are all good 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 gems but anyways yeah hopefully they have what i need so let's go into sephora hey, yeah. you? i don't have time so i'm in sephora and she Hi. is so beautiful look at her y'all i bet she i bet she's like 10 times more beautiful underneath the mask like yes. girl oh, I, I, should, I can show it to you Ooh. i gotta go <laughs> So she seen the camera and she was like, do you vlog? And I'm like, yes, I just vlog my everyday life. Who are you? Yeah. This one right here. Yeah. Dominique? Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, Let's see. see. Girl. You know, I'm kind of cute. I'm kind of cute. I'm not that cute right now. I think I'm going to be watching you. Thank like, you. Know, I'm going to go on YouTube and, you know, yes. subscribe to girl, I'm gonna, <laughs> Yes, girl, just subscribe today. <laughs> Okay, let me Anyways, I'm not gonna bother you, girl. I'm just walking around. And then just like do your thing? Yes. Y'all, she is so pretty. I walked in and I was like, who is this girl? She's stunning. I just came in here for their lip balm, which is this. But I wanna see if they have it. Um. Oh, it's back here. So it's in the shade Hint Hint. Just a basic like lip conditioner. That's all that I need. Oh my gosh, this background music. This is it. And it comes in like this sofa applicator here. So hopefully it's good. I'm not gonna test it out because that'd be disgusting. But um, I'm gonna just get the stick here. Okay, so the brow freeze is here. It's literally the last one. And I feel like this is a sign for me to just get it. But honestly, I don't know. I honestly don't know. Like, I'm still on the fence about it. But I feel like because it's the last one here, this is a sign. Uh, child, this is a sign. Oh, we're not going to get it. I also have the Hydro Grip Primer. But I feel like when I tried it out, it didn't do what it was supposed to do. Or maybe I just wasn't using it right. But I feel like I'm the only person on planet Earth that hasn't had a good um, experience with it. So, let's see. Girl, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> I think this is all I'm gonna get. Cause I really don't need anything else. So I think I'll just be fine with getting this. They have these minis and I've been wanting to test them out or like just try them out. Yeah, I'm gonna pick this up just to test it out. You can take 15% if you get a first I don't have any small bags though. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Actually, can I just get a um, a bag, whatever bag that y'all have? It doesn't matter. Thank you. Bye. I'm gonna see you on Instagram. Listen, yes, ma'am. And I've been looking at your uh, YouTube. Oh, uh, you already girl, you at work. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so yeah. that's my girl. Okay, she's love. And you work here too? No, she's a vendor, so she comes sometimes. So. Oh, okay. I know her oh, bread is like. I want to just grab it. And <laughs> Yeah, and it's okay. Oh, it's cute. <laughs> <laughs> Have a good night, y'all.
y'all. All right, let me go find her on Instagram. She's so beautiful. I seen her and I was like, I walked in and I was like, whoa. And it's so crazy. Like, I walked in there not vlogging initially, like just having a camera in my hand. And she looked at it and she was like, you're a vlogger? And I was like, yeah. And she just made me feel so comfortable, like, vlogging in the store. Like, it's, it's, it's really not that deep. I just have to get out of my own head. But anyways, I have this thing where like, if I'm going shopping, the store ran out of bags, which is very weird because this happens often, more often than it should, um, about them like running out of bags. They'll be like, oh, we don't have any more bags or any more small bags. So, you know, can you put it in your bag or anything like that? And I'm just like, no. <laughs> Every time that happens, I always say no. Like, just give me the bag that you have. I don't care if it's the biggest bag. And the reason why I do that is because, like, I'm not about to walk out of a store with items that I paid for without a bag. Like, it's just different, I guess, being black. And y'all gotta understand, like, being black, there's just certain things that, like, your senses are heightened to. So me walking out of a store or walking around a store with no bag and just the items that I bought, like, no, give me a bag. I don't care if the bag isn't marked with the brand's name or whatever, but I, I need a bag. So like, I only picked up a few things um, in Sephora and she was like, I don't have any more small bags. She was like, can you just, you know, do you want to put it in your bag? And I was like, yeah, that's fine. I thought about it and I was like, mm -mm, no, I don't want to put it in my bag. Just give me the bag that you have. <laughs> so I had to walk out with like this big old Sephora bag, even though I didn't buy that much stuff. But it's still the principle. Like, I'm not going to be, I'm not, I'm not going to try to put myself in that situation. I'm already put into certain situations literally just because I'm black. Like, I'm not about to, you're not about to stop me and be like, oh, ma'am, what? No. Nope. I paid for it and I'm not I'm not I'm not about to play games. Like we're really not about to do this. So yeah, every time they'll be like, oh, um, you know, we're running we're running low on bags or we don't have any bags that, you know, are small enough or big enough, and it's just like just give me a bag. I I don't care if I have to put three different items into three separate small bags, just give me the bag. Anyways, I'm headed off to um another store. Y'all, today I went on Amazon and bought like an adhesive piece to help with um, keeping my car mount on the dashboard. So I'm really excited for that to come in. It should be coming in between the hour. I paid to get it in between the hours of 4 a.m. and 8 a.m. because I really need that piece so I can prop y'all up in my car. I'm headed on over to TJ Maxx Home Goods or TJ Maxx, like the TJ Maxx area, Home Goods, Ulta, something like that. See what I can find there. <clears throat> there are just a few things that I need. I will go to Smoothie King. It's a five dollar Friday thing, so I was gonna go to Best Buy and get me the a new charger. <laughs> But I can't find the gift card. Like, I have a gift card to Best Buy that will help. And I just cannot find it. And it's not like I go to Best Buy often. So it's like, I don't want to go to Best Buy until I find that gift card. Because that's going to be a good little chunk off of my charger. Like, yeah. They had these perfumes in Ulta. Or not in Ulta, but in Sephora. I'm going to show y'all when I get to the house. But um, I also was able to pick up my birthday gift for the month of July. I'm so glad that she brought it up. I was thinking about it, but I was like, it's already August. But she was like, hey, you know, you could pick up your birthday present, blah, blah, blah. Um, so yeah, tonight, after I get home, I'm just gonna wind down a little bit. Also want to edit my video, my unboxing. I will talk to y'all when I get to um, Home Goods, TJ Maxx. I don't know, girl, something. Okay. I'm in TJ Maxx in the sleepwear section. And this is where I found my two piece set on Instagram. No, this is literally just a regular pajama. <laughs> but yeah, this is where I'll be finding my. Well, one of the places where you can find a two piece set. You just have to look and see if you see anything super cute. But other than that, like, this is a real. Pajama set, girl. Yeah. Mm -mm, no, girl. I just want some like cute sneakers. Not me saying I want cute sneakers, and I keep picking up sandals. What the hell is that? That was a bug that flew. <laughs> this is me. 
so damn simple. They be like, Carlo, so hard, but in real life, this is Carlo. Like, <laughs> y'all be like, oh my gosh, you know how to dress, but in real life, this is what I be looking like. <laughs> that is not. Oh, this is gorgeous. What y'all think she is black, or she? You think she white? I don't know. Sometimes I can't tell. Sometimes I can't tell. Oh, this is pretty. The cute pillows that I could use, but. Look at this mirror. <laughs> Look at this mirror. This is so big. I wouldn't do it though. It's too gaudy. And that mirror is just way too gaudy. It's that's not my vibe. Okay, so normally this owl usually has like um coffee books and stuff like that on display but I don't see anything so maybe they don't have any today or they are running low on it so oh there they go They're over here this is very pretty normally like if I'm looking for a coffee table book I'm really not looking for one but I do like the selection that Home Goods normally has. I look at the spine of it just to see if the spine is cute. If the spine is cute, then we could probably do something. But none of these spines look that cute. So, dream ones? Like, no. <laughs> no, girl. I don't, you know, I can't even say I don't need candles. Cause I ran out of my <laughs> forever mood candles. So I probably do need candles. Look at this one. This one looks so crooked. Child, I don't even want to mess with that. Probably do need candles, but I'm not in the mood. Look at oh, sand and fog. I love sand and fog's um, candles because they normally always smell pretty good. Not this one though. I might get this throw though. Cause that color. That color looks really nice. I hope y'all know, but I'm low-key preparing for the fall. I'm preparing for the fall. The colors, all that, like I'm, I'm for sure preparing for the fall. I think we're done, but you know me. I'm gonna look some more. Love your sneakers, they're so cute. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, I forgot the, the pictures. I don't think this is safe. One day or day one. This is cute. Was this like oh, the one you were this talking is like vlogging unapologetically who is that girl i don't know her anyways we're gonna i'm gonna put my my um i'm gonna put this to the test i'm about to go to target okay <laughs> i'm gonna go to target and see how well i do vlogging in target but i really do need some stuff from target i need um let's see i need a car mount this is just way too hectic but i need to pick up some dishware because they have like the cutest plates the plates that I eat off of, they're so cute. Very minimalistic, very simple, and nothing too major. I'm so dumb. You see, that's why vlogging, multitasking when you're looking for something specific is, is a no-go because I'm over here trying to vlog and I didn't pick up what I went to Home Goods for, which was a soap dispenser. 
I'll just have to see what Target has. I mean, Target ain't never let me down, but you know. Soap dispenser? Girl, this is literally what I need. We're gonna walk past this owl. And we're not going to look back. Okay. That's where I get all my plates from. And this one is my favorite. So cute and so simple. Very pretty and super simple. I was also thinking about getting like ones that are colored, but I really don't know if I'm ready for that yet. Like, not these black plates, but there's some other ceramic looking ones. There's some other ceramic plates that look more like, um, oh, there they go. Here, are these. I like the way that these look. And they're black. Very, very pretty. This part of Target is literally my one of my favorite spots parts about Target. It's like the little home area. They're always such cute little things. Oh, it's my favorite part. The furniture when they had like that little shaggy CV2 dupe here. I was considering getting it, but it's like that, would, that chair looks really hot. And with all these cute stuff, it's like my favorite part of Target. Look at this mirror. No, you have to see it up close. Oh, that is so cute. Ooh, that's so cute. Hmm. I don't like these, but I feel like I always buy shoes like these. This is cute. Are these cute? No, these are actually kind of cute. No, the lens are green, so everything is like tinted green. No, these are not it. No, I think these are it. These are cute. Okay. All right, I'm leaving. There's nothing else for me to look at. Hey y'all, today is Saturday. Really? Yeah, great. Anyways, today I am going to go out and take photos. I have an outfit set all ready to go. I just need to put on my clothes and go. It's currently 10.28 a.m., about to be 10.30. I don't really know what else I have planned for the rest of the day. Normally when I don't have things planned, I don't leave the house necessarily, like if that makes sense. Like, I don't like to just drive around and kind of like waste my time. Then I'm gonna go out and shoot, take some photos. And then, um, oh, I purchased the, the adhesive for the car mount and I paid a little bit extra to have it be shipped between the, between the time of 4 a.m. and 8 a.m. this morning. And like, it didn't dawn on me that I would need to be available, if that makes sense. I don't know, like, because I live in a complex that's gated. So how the hell, where were they gonna drop the package? You get what I'm saying? Like, where were they gonna drop the package? But then again, they could have went through the gate and just called me. I don't know. But I got a text at like 5.25 a.m. Like, how do we get inside the complex? And it's like, I should have just waited. <laughs> so I don't know if that means they're gonna try again later today, or if that just means I'm gonna have to wait until Monday to get it. But the reason why I wanted it to come in so early is because it takes about 24 hours. I have to leave it on the dashboard for about 24 hours for it to adhere to the dashboard. Yeah, I'm about to get ready or I'm about to just throw on some clothes, I have the outfit ready to go. I'll show y'all in a second. All I, all I really do have planned though is to take photos. 
I know I have to go get something to eat. Like, I, I want to go out and get something to eat. I try not to get food during the week or purchase food during the week because I really be going through it during the weekend. Like, I really be, I really be eating out on the weekend. That is, that's just something that I love to do. Oh, let me show y'all the, can I show y'all what I got from Sephora? One second. <laughs> So these are the things that I got from Sephora. I picked up the Fenty Beauty Luscious Lip Balm. The shade Hint Hint, which is just a clear hydrating lip balm. I used it last night and then I also used it today. And I don't know, like the, the, the chapstick that I normally put on, which is the cocoa butter one. I don't know. I'll get it in a second. But that one, when I put it on, for some reason, be a minute or two in, my lips start to get warm. I don't know what it is. Like, it's like, it's heating up on my lips and it does not feel good. So I just wanted something a little bit cuter and not just regular, like $1, $2 chapstick. I know, I know it, it might be hella bougie for me to have done this. I wouldn't top this over. Like I wouldn't use this as a lip gloss or anything like that. This is literally just to hydrate my lips. Okay. Just just to hydrate my lips. Um, I also was able to pick up my birthday gift. This is like a Laneige um, trio. So it comes with a water sleeping mask, a water bank moisture cream, and a lip sleeping mask. And then the last thing that I picked up from Sephora, which I didn't even know I was gonna get, bro. Like, you know how like when you're walking out of the Sephora line, they have like the little trial size things of literally everything that you might ever need? Yeah. Um, I, seen, <laughs> I seen this duo from YSL oh my gosh it's the Libre Eau de Parfum and the Black Opium I've been wanting to try I feel like I really want to get into Black Opium but every time I spray it it's like I'm not a fan so when I seen the Libre one I was like oh girl I have to get it I have to get this duo this was their oh I didn't mention the prices this was $30 the Fenty Beauty lip, lip balm was 18 and obviously the birthday gift was free these are two travel size perfumes which I was excited about I was hoping like I didn't want to get a um edt or eau de toilette i didn't want to do that these are edt edps so they're going to last longer but look how small and compact they are they're so cute and it's like real glass um and then this one here small and compact they don't have like a spray this is count this is an oil so you'll have to like tap it onto your skin rub it in whatever it is that you do but I'm really excited because these smell so good. Just off the bat, they smell so good. But I really want to see how this um, black opium is going to work with my body chemistry. Because like I said, every time I spray, I'm just like not a huge fan of it. But I really want to try it just because I like the way the bottle looks. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to get dressed. I'm going to get ready so I can go be on my way, girl. Be on my way before, you know, the city wakes up. I mean, the city's probably already woke. It's already almost close to 11 o'clock. But you know, yeah. Let me get ready. I will talk to you all soon. All right, y'all. This is my outfit that I'm gonna go shoot in. It's always a damn water bottle somewhere, bro. This shirt is from Forever 21. The pants are from H&M. The shoes are Saucony. I got them from DSW on sale for like, what, I paid less than $40 for these sneakers. The shades are from Target. I got them last night. This is the item that I picked up from Target that I didn't mention earlier. Sorry about that. Now it's here. The bag is from Telfar. But yeah, y'all, this is my outfit. I think it's pretty cute. It's really, it's very chill. It's giving like, I'm prepared for the fall already. Like, that's what it's giving. Like, look at me, I'm ready for the fall. Hello, that's, <laughs> that's what it's giving. Put some stuff together and head out so I could go take some photos. Okay, if you want to see how these photos turn out, go ahead and follow me on Instagram. You know, do what you want to do. I think this will give y'all a better view of the shirt. Cute. Oh my gosh, this sound like that one dude. I think it's Hey Tony TV when he like dresses up as school administrators and he's always like saying let his keys. <laughs> this was an amazing shoot. I had so much fun. Y'all are gonna be able to tell with my photos. Like y'all gonna be able to tell that like I had. Way too much fun.
this is my food. I got catfish. Beans. And a side of mac and cheese. I gotta get a quick video for Instagram. Okay. This is my first time here. I've never had this before. So hopefully it tastes good. Let me pray real quick. That's what the greens look like. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> nice and cheese. Yeah. 10 out of 10 will recommend Liggity Splits. Oh my gosh, that was so good. It was good. Good, and I literally came at like the perfect time because when I went back inside, like 15 minutes later to go pick up to get my order. The line was like hella long. Like the catfish, I knew I wanted catfish. If it's one thing y'all gonna know about me, one, it's like it's that I love to eat. I love to eat. And I low-key don't even hesitate when it comes to spending money on food. <laughs> okay. That's one thing I was that's literally where all my money goes. Not clothes, not shoes, not you know, accessories for me to dress up in or anything like that. It's, it's, it's literally because I like to eat. Like if you call me, you're like, hey, you wanna go out to eat? I'm literally gonna beat you there. I'm just kidding. I might not beat you there. I'm probably gonna be late because I'm always late and I need to work on my timeliness. The food was so good. They have like a little outdoor seating area. I decided to sit outside, even though it's kind of hot. Um, it's shaded, so that was fine. I didn't feel like being inside, y'all, because I feel like nowadays, every time I go out, I'm so paranoid about like getting sick and I'm just like, I just want to lessen my chances. I just want to lessen my chances, but I sat outside. It was a cute little vibe, but the food, oh my gosh, the catfish. Catfish did what she needed to do, okay? Get the catfish if you go to Liggity Splits. It's in the College Park area, I think, or Hapeville. I think it's Hapeville. I think it's called Hapeville, but so good. I got me just like water because I was out shooting all day or earlier this morning and I haven't had anything to drink really, so. Pretty much almost everybody in there had a mask on, so you don't have to worry about that. The way that it works is that there is a front entrance on the main road, but there's no parking. So if you come here, you're gonna have to obviously come to the back and there's an entrance in the back. There's like a line, so you have to wait in line. If there's a line, um, look at the mini. Damn, I forgot to do that. Oh no, I didn't. I got a video of it. And then when they call you up, you go to the register and put in your order. I ordered my food and then I also ordered a plate for Anthony. So if you're planning on getting food to like go, then just order it all at once. Because if you don't, if you go sit down and you come back in and get another order, you're gonna have to wait in line. And I feel like I came at the perfect time. Y'all seen when I walk in, it wasn't nobody there. The line is, I feel like, to the door at this point. Very cute in there. Very chill, nothing too crazy, nothing too major, like with decorative decorations or anything like that. Um, but again, the food, oh my goodness. This is about to be my new spot. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, y'all, I have nothing else to do. I'm gonna head home and um, that's it for the rest of the day. All right, y'all, so. Y'all know that TikTok, that little glitch girl? <laughs> Am I too old to be on TikTok? It is Sunday, August 8th. Earlier today, let me take these shades off. Earlier this morning, I got up and filmed my everyday makeup routine. I also filmed a Prada unboxing right here. Before you see this vlog, you'll see the Prada unboxing. It's already up on my channel, so make sure you go check it out. Uh, Anthony and I are gonna are on our way to, or getting ready to head out. All right, y'all, so this is my outfit of the day. I just have on this shirt from PacSun. Uh, these shorts are from Shein. The bag is also from Shein. Don't mind the bags on the floor because I was testing out to see which one I wanted to wear with this outfit. 
Uh, and then I have these laser orange dunks that Anthony got me for my birthday. And that's it. Oh, and I have some shades. You see how this outfit look with no shades, right? I'm telling you, get some accessories. Like, that's all you really have to do. Just get some accessories. And then boom, you got shades on. You cute. Ain't nobody trying to mess with you. Okay, let these niggas know. Let these niggas know. You're not the one to play with. Big purr. <laughs> Big purr. <laughs> hey, what you got on? Okay, so the shirt. Something simple. Scotch and soda. No problem. <laughs> You know, just got on some, some regular jeans. I believe these are from PacSun and my Jordan 3 since I never really wore my shoes. So, I had to bring them Girl, no, since you never really wear your shoes. All you do is wear your shoes. I know, but I got to wear the rest of them. Anyway, um, we're heading out. All right. So, for today's scent, I don't know any shades, whatever, it doesn't matter. I'm going to wear this YSL Libre. Um, which I got from Sephora. I'm just gonna test it out, see how it works. Put it in. I also sprayed, <laughs> this is extra, but I'm, I sprayed the Giorgio Armani C as well. Nada's trying to find parking for almost like 15 minutes. And it's a game. I didn't even know it was a game. If I knew it was a game, I don't think I would've came, but whatever, I'm glad that we're here. But parking, wild as hell. Parking was wild as hell. Asian restaurant, Feast. Ooh, Feast, that's cute. How they spelled it? That's real cute. We can get an ice cream, because I want some ice cream. I do. It's just the game. I think everybody is this Wahlburger? Yeah. It better be good. Me stuff like a burrito, holy wall burger. I give, I give wall burgers. Come on, let's argo. Um, we're pedestrians. I feel like I'd give wall burgers mm, seven. No, I'd give it a seven. Why seven? Cause it was good, but it wasn't like it was a nothing that I ain't never tasted before. I mean, I don't really know what takes. I don't feel like I feel like people shouldn't expect much from a burger. A burger gonna be a burger unless you're trying to like. Make it real gourmet like. Should I get some Jenny's? I'm not gonna eat it. How are y'all? We're leaving. It was a good time. It was hot. I mean, it is hot, but we're leaving. Had a great time. You enjoyed yourself?
Because it gives the drink a different taste. It do. Make it taste like... That's too much salt. Good tacos, Queso. ten Lizzie's. Out of <laughs> the raindrop right on my eye. Come on, we gotta get out of here. It's about to storm. It's a hurricane coming. <laughs> it just started raining really hard for a bit, and we had to move inside. But now we're leaving, going home. The drinks were really good. We got the the flight, so it's like four different drinks. Is it raining hard? Or is it just a tree? We got the flight, which was four different drinks. They were good. I think they just have a thing for like spicy drinks. The damn drinks were so spicy, but it's really raining. Oh my gosh. The service was great. And we had a good time. And it's such a cute little vibe. Like the outside area is a cute little vibe. If you wanna go there for drinks, like little, I think it's tapas. I'm really not sure, but we didn't really look at the food menu. We just looked at the drink menu. Come on, Bigfoot. Thank you, Kevin. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> the storms are brewing. There's Bula Gastro. The girl's like, you YouTubing? <laughs> yes. Yeah, she was saying, um, get it. Like, yeah, she said, get it. <laughs> she was like, he's vlogging. I love that. I love when people like, they don't look at me crazy. All right, we finna go, we finna go home, okay? I had my fun for today. That was just the right amount of fun. All right. I feel like if we would've went, look how I look when I'm vlogging. This how I look when I'm vlogging, y'all. I'm gonna get ran over. Cause I'll be the bitch ass. I'll whoop a bitch ass. We gotta go. Storm's coming. Hey y'all, today is Monday, August 9th. And I'm sitting here about to edit a reel, but I'm over here thinking like, I can't believe that it's already August. Like I know we're a few days into August, but we're already into August. <sighs> anyway, I just did some work today. Uh, I seasoned some meat. I'm gonna make some shrimp tacos and I'm also gonna make some beef taco or some pork tacos or something like that. I just cut up some pork and I'm gonna Make some tacos with corn tortillas. I wasn't a fan of corn tortillas for a minute, but they grew on me and I really, really like corn tortillas. It's almost like, but it can't just be from anywhere because some corn tortillas just taste fake and very rubbery. That's why I didn't like corn, torti corn tortillas. But um, if you like corn tortillas, let me know in the comments down below. But yeah, I am in the week, in one of my hardest weeks at the moment, which is the week where I need to decide what my nail design is gonna be for my next appointment, okay? Because I have an appointment, well, I need to make an appointment, but before I can make an appointment, I have to text them with like, you know, the design, all that information, and I can't set an appointment without a, without a design because the nail place that I go to, they specialize in nail art. So I guess it when you send them the, the nail design, it gives them time to like, um, figure out where they can place you depending on how long that design is going to take. I need to figure that out so I can see about getting an appointment this weekend. I just booked an appointment to get waxed, uh, to get her waxed, you know what I mean? But yeah, I just made an appointment to get waxed for tomorrow. So I'm really excited about that because I want to get that over with. I've just also recently posted my unboxing of my Prada bag. But like, I don't know, I, f I felt confident filming the video. I felt confident editing it and posting it. But like maybe an hour after I posted it, nothing in particular happened, but I just started to feel very guilty. Like, should I have posted an unboxing? Is that what I mean? Like just kind of questioning the fact that I'm 
unboxing something that is considered a luxury item and something that isn't obviously attainable to a lot of people because hashtag America, like, I felt really guilty about it. But at the same time, it's like, some people, like, I had to think about it, like, some people only buy luxury items. And honestly, I love watching people like that. I like watching um, videos on YouTube where the women are doing luxury unboxings, um, luxury hauls, because that's their everyday lifestyle, you know what I mean? I just have a good balance of both. Like, I like to watch people on YouTube who are very, very realistic, realistic as in I can relate to them, and then other people on YouTube who are out here spending big money every week at, you know, luxury designer stores because it's just fun to watch. Like, it's not a thing of, oh my gosh, I wish that was me or woe was me and I just want to be like them. It's nothing like that. It's just, I like it, you know? Sometimes you watch things that you can relate to and then sometimes you watch things that are of a fantasy of some sort or something that's kind of like out of reach but doesn't make you feel bad about it. Like, I love watching black women frolic and luxury like i just like it i like i just love it i like watching tanika boyd on youtube and her just talking just so casually about hermes and chanel i might just like watching videos like that it's just it's just nice you know and i just love seeing women whether they're older or younger just like around my age just like really tapping into some luxury items and it's just nice you know nothing really major is going on today so i'm just gonna edit a reel so that way i have some content to put out and that'll be it oh yeah today is thursday happy thursday y'all it's august 12th today is going to be a pretty busy day um i wanted to hop on camera though real quick to tell y'all about an event that's coming in that's about to happen this saturday in atlanta t sent me um their flyer and just was like she just dropped it in my DMs on Instagram. So as soon as I seen it, I was like, oh, I'm getting tickets. <laughs> so it's the All Women's Streetwear uh, 2021 Market. This is on the Pretty, Fa Pretty Fresh page. They have their own separate um, Instagram called Atlanta's Atlanta Streetwear Market. So I'm going to go... So I'm going to go and see what that's about. I already bought my ticket just to peep it out or whatever. I was so excited that I already picked out my outfit. Yeah, I already know what I'm wearing, so I don't have to worry about that. Oh, let me explain it to y'all, right? That would be nice. So this all women's streetwear market, it's like they sell all women-owned businesses um, items out of this market. I'm so excited. I'm excited to see what they get. So yeah, these are all women-owned businesses. And I think more importantly, a lot of them are going to be black-owned businesses. So... I'm excited. And then they have speakers. Yeah, they have some speakers coming to talk. Uh, they're presenting it as Cloth Talk um, from 3.30 to 4.30 on Saturday. So I'm probably going to try to get there around 2. Because I want to hear what they have to say. Like, I want to hear what this panel has to say. Um, they're going to be talking about how to successfully navigate as a creative um, and the business of fashion entrepreneurship as well fashion and entrepreneurship as well. So it's gonna be an open discussion and a Q&A session. So I wanna see, because I don't mind asking questions. Like I really don't mind asking questions. So y'all, what I really wanna find though, is I wanna find a trucker hat. I feel like I want a trucker hat so bad, but I just I just don't know where to find one. Like, also, the place where I go get my nails done, they texted me and said that the lady that was supposed to be doing my nails got into a car accident. I really do hope she's okay. Um, and I tried to like, you know, they tried to help me with working around a different schedule and it's not gonna work. The latest they would have, the er, the only time that they had for me to come in on Saturday, the close on Sunday is 3.30. And I don't, 3.30, and then you gotta think about it, it's probably gonna take like an hour and a half to do my nails. By then it's like almost five o'clock and it's like my whole day is gone into Saturday. I'm not trying to be in the nail salon at 3.30. I think I'm just gonna go get my nails filled and done at another nail salon that's closer to me that's just a little bit closer to me um i have a really simple design in mind like i showed y'all before so hopefully they're able to do that if not i'm just probably gonna get like some colored french tips which is extremely basic but 
I would rather do like a basic thing and like them rather than a design and they'll try the hardest and it's like, why did I get this design? I hate it. Let me see if I could try to go in the nail salon actually today. Yeah, I'm gonna stop rambling. I will chat with y'all later. Oh, also, last night I bought an insert for my Prada backpack. You would have heard that I mentioned getting an insert for the backpack because there's no structure to it and there's nothing in there except for like space so i wanted to get a an organizer to organize the backpack when i am using it so that should be here on friday oh i did get a notification that my ego official order was delivered that's the thing about ego like ego will really get you girl like am i i think in my last vlog or something i was like if you want a quick item from if you want your items quick and you order if you want something quick don't order it from ego girl ego definitely tried it i had to email them which they're really good at getting back to you via email, like quickly as well. And um, I emailed them and they sent me an email back. And then literally like at 12 a.m., 1 o'clock in the morning, I got an email saying that, oh, it's been delivered. Child wear. So I'm about to go to the mailbox, actually. Oh my gosh, I'm so tired. Okay. Got my package from Ego. That's the thing, like, they never sent me tracking. They didn't send me... A notification none of that until I asked so I just ordered me some black dad sandals very excited I just need some like simple everyday sandals honestly this is the box this is the box that it comes in I got it in a US 7 that's my normal size these are the sandals So cute. So, so cute. I'm excited. Oh, these are so cute. Such a vibe. Do they make like platform dad sandals? I love me a good platform shoe. Like I love platform platforms, whatever you want to call them. I love them. Do they fit? Why are they too small? Why is my big toe out the damn shoe? Girl, you know what? We're gonna do it for a little saint. We're gonna try to do it for a little saint. We're gonna try to do it for a little saint. I don't know. Honestly, if I don't get these, like I'm not tripping. I really got some shoes. Well, them Nikes. Um that I really like. Let me give it like two minutes. We'll see. <laughs> Why did I join this draw? Why? I low-key hope I don't get them. <laughs> Cause I just realized that like, the Travis Scott Air Jordan 1's are coming out. Why did I join this draw? Please don't let me get them. Please don't let me get them. Please don't let me get them. If I get them, I'm selling them. Like these shoes, I'm actually gonna sell them. This is my girl. Still no notification yet from the sneakers app. Three, two, one. And again, like I said, I wouldn't be mad if I didn't get these. You gotta pick and choose. Like, we are not out here buying sneakers every day just because they're dropping. Like, no, uh -uh, no, we're not. That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. Again. That's fine. We're gonna try again tomorrow. Um, I will talk to y'all later. <laughs> hey Google. Hey Google. I told Google to turn off the music. Google turned up the music. Like, good, how are you? You wanna see the color, man? I'm sorry? You wanna see the color? Uh, white. Oh, you want white? Oh, white? Hello, y'all. Today is Friday, August 13th, Friday the 13th. And I just got my package in the mail from Amazon. Look how it came packaged. Just in the clear plastic bag, pretty much. But yeah, this is the liner that I ordered from Amazon. I'm kind of nervous. I feel like I ordered a, a liner that's a little too big. But um, I ordered it in green. Cause I wanted some color, you know what I mean? I just wanted some color. They come in a whole bunch of different colors, but I decided to go with this green color. 
just because I would have gotten orange. You know what? I probably would have gotten orange if there was orange, but yeah, this is it. It's just an organizer for your bag. I will leave this linked down below. It also comes with this middle compartment as well. So you can see there's Velcro on the sides um, that attach to the inside of this. Kind of nervous. I don't know if this is gonna be too big or not, but if it is, I'll just exchange it out. Let me go get the bag. Yeah, y'all, I, I think it's gonna be too big. It's crazy because I looked at the measurements. <laughs> it is not gonna fit. I feel like I'm going to need, I looked at the measurements and everything to measure like the bottom of the bag and it measures perfectly. I, yeah, this is a large, I'm gonna send it back uh, to exchange it for a small. I think I'm just gonna get a small, I don't know. Yeah. I'm gonna do the all-star special, please. A soft scrambled with cheese, and may I add another egg to it, please? Bacon. Hash browns, please. Thank you. We're getting Waffle House. Hello, good morning, everybody. It is Saturday, August 14th. I am going to get some Waffle House. I'm gonna film a few things this morning before I head out. And I have somewhere to go today, so I'm excited. I'm gonna meet up with T. We're going to the Atlanta, Atlanta Streetwear Festival, I don't know, convention. Hmm. But yeah, I'm hungry and I wanna get me something to eat this morning before I just like, do everything and skip out on breakfast because I always do that and I, I should really stop doing that, especially when I'm gonna be out here in the sun. <laughs> just got me some breakfast, just ordered it. I'm gonna go pick it up and I'll be right back. So I'm in the car and this is the disc. I don't really know, I think the lighting is messing it up, but this is the adhesive disc that I got from Amazon. This is the stand. I'm gonna try to place it on here right now. Yep, it's on there. Hey y'all, so this is my outfit to go to the expo. I just have on these pants from Zara, my ones. This sheer dress, I got from Shein maybe like four years ago. And then I have on my LA hat, my makeup. Yeah, I really like this outfit. I just don't know what bag to wear, honestly. Uh, I can wear my healthy hose tote. Look at this. Wait, does this go? This is pretty cute. I'm about to wear this healthy hose tote and call it a day, which you bitches like. So I'm about to head out to meet T. I'm just gonna pack my bag really quickly for like shooting items and stuff like that. I need to bring my tripod, the charger for this camera. Yeah, let me just get my life together. Hold on. Hello. Oh my gosh, I'm able to have y'all in the car with me. That's crazy. Oh my gosh, I think it might be a little bit shaky, but I'm close by, I'm three minutes away. I brought cash with me, so I won't have to worry about using my car. I wanna be hopeful and say like, oh my gosh, I hope parking is good, but honestly, I don't like to hold my breath when it comes to parking, but it is so hot outside, y'all. It's so hot outside, baby, it's like, it gotta be in the 90s. I went back upstairs into the house to get, get my black girl sunscreen, only to go upstairs and forget it. Like, I went upstairs for a few things. I went back upstairs to get water, sunscreen, and hand sanitizer. The only thing that I got was hand sanitizer, uh, was the water bottle. Forgot my rings at the house. I ain't got no rings on. The outfit's cute though. You know, the outfit's cute. I think it'll suffice <laughs> without the rings. <laughs> All these, the rolls are trash. Like, girl, get it together. I hope, I'm, I hope I'm in the right area. Like, I hope I put the right address in. I think I did. Oh, what the hell? Y'all, I got my nails done. Literally, I got my nails done two days ago. Why is the gel already chipping? Look at that. Cute though. She did a really good job. But why are my nails already chipping? How did it work? How? <sighs> yeah, we're here. Oh jeez. Additional parking. Where do you go to park? Mm. Yeah. Clearly there aren't any 
There's no like real parking. Oh, we gotta figure something out. There's no parking. <clears throat> All right, so it says additional parking right here in this like grassy area. So I'm gonna see about parking in here. Let me tell T. Oh. Hello. Hey. Damn. I'm like 15 minutes away. Please don't kill me. No, it's okay. The parking is just like really bad. Girl, it is just horrible. Um, do they even have a parking lot? They do. Not, okay. The thing is like, they have a parking lot, but it's like, I'm gonna send you a picture of what it's, of what it looks like because, girl, no. I don't see no parking attendants <laughs> um, at all, but I mean, it's parking, so. It says additional parking, so hopefully this works. I hope no spiders come in my shit. I do not like spiders. Mm -mm, I do not like spiders. T said she is 15 minutes away, so that's not a problem. Um. I'm gonna just wait for her to get here. You know what? Let me let me park. Let me park in between so that way Tierra has a spot next to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna park right here. I'm gonna park right here. I'm gonna just sit and wait. <laughs> I'm not even tripping that she's running late because I, I'm always running late. So. <laughs> that is okay. I was over here trying to like rush. I'm over here rushing to like leave the house because T is never late. So I was like, I can't, this can't be like our 15th million time hanging out and I'm steadily late, so. Did you need to go? No. 
I, if you didn't go, did you miss out on something? No. Now, T and I are on our way to go take some pictures. I am in downtown. Um, T and I are supposed to link up over here to take photos. Um, ooh, I think I might want to go back to that spot that I was taking photos at. I feel like I want to take pictures by this door. Is this T? I end up being right behind her. Oh! Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We can go over there. Okay. Oh, this is cute. I think I might have found a cute little spot. Uh, it's in the alleyway. This is cute. Well, yeah. It say it say tollways on, but we're gonna be I'm gonna be right by my car, so right to your left, like uh the green paneling with the white curtains. T the left, <laughs> not the right. Um, right here. Yes. Right. Oh yes. <laughs> Let me do this real quick test shot. Whew. The guys are out shooting a music video. Let me show y'all. They're shooting a music video. Right in front of us. T just got done taking some photos of me. They have the camera propped on the back of the car. So cool, I love that. Y'all shooting a music video? Yeah. Cute, I like it. <laughs> You're welcome. You ready? Um, I'm on Instagram. Come on, come on right there, let me get your info. Boy, chocolate thing. <laughs> yeah, we love that chocolate. Oh, okay. I'm not trying to be in a music video, you hear me? I'm not trying to be in a music video. <laughs> I don't want to be in a video, Vixen. Hey y'all, so I'm back in the house from going to the expo and also taking photos with T era. T, that's my boo. We always have a really good time together. Okay, so about the Atlanta streetwear, Atlanta streetwear, whatever. It was okay, you know? It was all right. I didn't really see anything that I was like I couldn't leave without. I need to be really specific about the things that um, I buy. Like I don't wanna get things just to get them. The only two things that I can say that I really considered purchasing were those Lueve dupe sunglasses, those shades, those black and white ones, those are fire, and the orange or the green trucker hat. I forget the brand's name. But yeah, other than that, like it was okay. I didn't really see a lot of fly girls out there. I ain't gonna lie. The girls had on just, it wasn't giving. I thought they were gonna give. That's the thing, like I really thought the girls were gonna give. I thought they were gonna come with something because it's streetwear, women's streetwear, like that's what I thought. I thought it was gonna give just that and it didn't to me. I'm not saying I'm the flyest, but I just didn't. That's not what I expected. I expected to see like the girls dressed up, you know what I mean? Like, looking good. Anyways, I had a decent time. I'm glad I went out. On the way back home though, a storm was a brewing, okay? A storm is making its way to the city, all right? Like, I felt my, the wind was winding, the sand was sanding, the trees, the debris were trees and debris. Like, it was just flying across the interstate and I'm just like, Lord, just please let me get home. Please, I'm just asking to get home. I felt the car move in. It started raining heavily for a second and I'm just like, God, please let me get home. But yeah, I'm home. I ain't going out there, child. It's looking kind of wild. But T took me some bomb photos. Like she took me some really fire photos. Um, I don't really have anything else planned. Yeah, that's it. Bye y'all. I am in the kitchen now because I, my shirt is on backwards, oh my gosh. I tried to film a reel and nothing, it just wasn't working out for me. So I said, skirt, I'm finna go get me something to eat, or make me something to eat. I'm gonna make me a burger tonight with some fries, nothing too major, um, and just finish editing this vlog. So this is the end of the vlog. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please make sure that you are liking this video, subscribe. Please make sure that you are giving this video a thumbs up, you're subscribing, and you know, like extra bonus. Just go watch what I do on Instagram. Like, just go see what's going on over there. If you like it, you can stick around. If you don't like it, just stay on YouTube, okay? But yeah, that is it. I hope you all enjoyed, like I said, and I will see you all in my next vlog. Bye, y'all.